Have you ever wondered what the difference is between all these different curl defining creams? Come hang out with me today while I put two of these curl defining creams to the test. Are you ready? Let's do this. Hello, my curlies. Erica here from Coils and Curls, and welcome back to another Frizz Free Friday. In this video, we are finishing up the AG Curl Line. So we are using the details, which is their defining cream. And to make it more fun, we are challenging it against the Amica Curl Core Defining Cream two defining creams side by side, and we are gonna figure out which one works better. Okay, my curlies, we are up to the details defining cream. Let's see how thick the details is. That's pretty thick. It stays put, doesn't move. They don't tell you how much to use. <sighs> open for interpretation. Now, their directions are to scrunch. I don't feel like you get near the scalp where you also need some control and frizz protection. So we know I am not going to scrunch it in. Well, maybe I should and see how it really works. Hmm. All right, let's do it. The details to finding cream is supposed help calm frizz, define your curls, and add shine. They do use their exclusive curl creating complex, which we know is rice and tomato seed extract. I am using another little bit, especially for the back, and maybe my top. I don't feel like I really got much up there. Now, they also still use all of their regular herbal complexes, such as the angel of flower, the chamomile, they still use the hops, the sage, the rosemary and the nettle, all of this to help with retaining moisture, keeping moisture, and defining your curls. Now, personally, I am not fond of soft holds. I never felt like they controlled my curls enough, and then I would never seem to get second not even third, and no way was I getting a fourth day out of them. We will try this, and although this is two days before I am posting, I am going to try to at least give you photographs of what the hair looks like the day before I post. No guarantees, my curlies. No guarantees. I feel like there needs to be a little more right here. I'm putting up in a clip so that I don't mix them up because I have a tendency to do that. <laughs> to prep for today's video, I did use the Curl Revive Curl Hydrating Shampoo and the Curl Thrive, which is their Curl Hydrating Conditioner. After I rinsed it out, I used the Fast Food, which is their Leave On Conditioner. We are moving on to the Amica Curl Core Defining Cream. How to use, how to use, no guidelines on amount. Work through damp hair, scrunch, and air dry or style as usual. Lots of help, don't you think? We know I love when things are open for interpretation and that is usually when I use too much. <laughs> now for the Amica, this is very thick. I had to shake it down to get it to the top. Oh, that's thick. That's thick. That holds its shape. Hmm. Let's see. I think I used about the same amount, don't you think? Maybe? Possibly? The Amico Curl Core. This is supposed to leave your curly hair soft and moisturize. Define our curls and coils. Now, it's supposed to be lightweight, but it seemed kind of thick. So we're gonna have to see about that. It is a moisturizing styling cream that is supposed to leave our curls, coils and waves bouncy and soft to the touch. Now, this is also supposed to create lasting curls. <laughs> we'll see. 
this is how much I'm using extra with my hair in it. So I used about another, let's say a teaspoon, but I really want to get it in this part area where I always seem to frizz because I never put enough there. Back to the Amica Curl Core Defining Cream. So it is supposed to encourage our curl formation as well as leave our hair with a no crunch, which you know sometimes I have a problem with. It's supposed to leave our curls soft but defined. Now I am not hearing much squish, which kind of bothers me, and I'm not sure if I need more. But yes, I know someone is gonna tell me you use too much. I won't blow raspberries at you this week. I feel like there is not much back here. It doesn't feel slippery. So I do think I am going to put another little bit just in that part. It doesn't feel right. And as curlies, you have to go by feel. If you don't go by feel, then your hair won't be properly coated. So I'm using another little bit. Some of the key ingredients that the Amica has in its products is oat peptide. Now, oat peptides form a protective barrier around the hair so that it locks in moisture. Another ingredient they use is tapioca starch. You think tapioca, you think starch. I know, it sounds a little odd, but trust me. <laughs> it does help to provide definition to the hair and give you that soft hold. One other key ingredient that they use is saw buckthorn. I don't know if any of you have ever heard of this. This is one of the most potent natural ingredients on the planet. It's a super fruit, but it's one of the few known plants that has omega-7 in it. Omega-7 is a fatty acid, and it's usually found in fish. Sea buckthorn actually has omega-7 in it. Two of the benefits of the sea buckthorn, this gives your hair elasticity, so that it doesn't snap and break, and it gives you superior hydration. Now you are going to want to stick around till the end of this week's video because I have money-saving info for you, my girlies. You want to save money? I've got your back. We also need to see what happens. Which has the most hold? Which has the most definition? Which has the most shine? Which one do I like better? Now we have finished all of the AG products. I will continue to play so that we can figure out what works best. And I am trying to get rid of this part because we know I don't like the parts. Not doing like a real smoothing job, a half-assed smoothing job. If your hair feels like it's too sticky, you are definitely going to want to add a little moisture. Not only will it help soften the hair, it'll help create that bend that our curls need. Once it starts to dry, it starts to get hard and it sets fairly quickly. Does this seem too off? Does it seem off? Or is it just me? Yes, me. Okay, now let's see what we can do about getting some cute curls. Here goes my little barbershop quartet curls. I will have my affiliate links down below in the descriptions for you. Remember, using the links are free. It doesn't cost you anything. What it does do is it helps me so that I can keep making quality content. I don't wanna put crap out there. I wanna give you guys what you need. We're not kids, so we don't need all those bells and whistles. <laughs> what we need is information, a little entertainment, which I love to provide. And the one thing I want to say is that I really appreciate you all for trusting me with your curls. I am truly grateful. It is time now for my blow dry with the Bellissima Diphon Supreme Diffuser. It helps to reduce the frizz, 
without blowing the hair all over. I mean, this diffuser has blown me away. I mean, I liked my hot sock, that was fine. I liked my blow dryer, but this, 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 I can't believe it. I am so blown away by this diffuser. It's ridiculous, but I love this diffuser. <laughs> I, I need a life, don't you think? <laughs> I am going to blow dry, and when I come back, we're gonna see what these curls look like. You can see I stuck in a few clips as it was drying. This way it didn't fall on me. Let's take a look at these still shots that I took. When I looked in the other room, I really thought that the details defining cream looked shinier and more defined. But when I looked at the photos that I took before I hit record again, I think it's the Curl Core Defining Cream that has more shine. I feel like both of them, they're not crunchy. It definitely feels defined, but not hard. It has a little bit of a cast, but not like if you used a gel where it looks wet. I wanna know what you think down in the comments below. What side do you think looks better? Is it the details or is it the curl core? And now you know what we're going to do. Say it with me, my curlies. We are going to de-crunchify. De-crunchify right there, my word. We are going to de-crunchify with the AG the oil, which is their extra virgin argon oil. One pump. I know, you know I can't do one pump. I can't, I just can't. <laughs> I am going to flip and fluff and de-crunchify, but it really doesn't need to be de-crunchified, but I'm gonna do it anyway. <laughs> Barefoot and everything. No slippers and socks this time, my girlies. Oh, I forgot to take out a clip. Christmas tree. Out. Let go. There you go. Okay, now we're ready. <sighs> what does it look like? Oh my goodness gracious. Wow. I have volume on both sides, don't you think? Wow. Okay, I'm a little impressed. Okay, I'm a lot impressed. What can I say? Hmm. Let's take a look together. This is the AG line, the details defining cream. The back. And this is the Amica Curl Core defining cream. Well, let me know what you think. Which side do you think looks better? Which side has more shine? We will know by tomorrow which side held up better while sleeping. Especially with the menopausal night sweats. Sometimes they're better than others. But my curlies, you know what I'm talking about. Because all of us are either perimenopause or postmenopause. Unless you're a man. And then you don't have to worry about that except for midlife crisis and getting a sports car. <laughs> Are you ready now for the money-saving information that I have for you? Now, normally, I only put this down in the descriptions, but I am shouting it to you. Down below in descriptions, I will have the AG affiliate link along with a coupon code for 20% off, which is very generous. So I hope you all take advantage of that through my link. And secondly is Bellissima Daifun Diffusers, whether you choose the original or the Supreme, also has a discount code down below for 10% off. It's an expensive dryer, so it kind of helps. Hit the thumbs up down below, thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't, because really, what are you waiting for? And share me, share me, share me like teens do with a bottle of blackberry schnapps. <laughs> Sorry, that was my youth. I am also doing video consultations. This way you get a one-on-one -on -one with me. 
We can go through issues that you're having. We can go through product recommendations. You tell me what it is that you're using, what it is that you're not happy with, and then we try to formulate something together to get you the curls of your dreams. If you are having trouble with styling your curls because you're unsure of what to do, we can spend the session with you having a wet head, applying the products, and styling and drying your hair with me. It's almost like me being there because I direct you every step of the way. I hope if you're having trouble with your curls that you will take advantage of video consultations with moi. We have come to the end of another Frizz Free Friday. I will see you next week, my curlies. Ciao for now. Their exclusive curl creating con concept. <laughs> I did use the Details Curl Thrive Curl Hydrating Conditioner and the, oh no, but we're gonna give it a try. So let's see how thick this is. Oh, this seems kind of thick. Oh crap, potent. This is one of the most <laughs> impotent, I was gonna say impotent. I think it needs a little moisture on it. Yes, I'm falling over. And, and what? I don't know. What will wind up being the most frizzy on you? I think I just ate my, <laughs> I just ate my mic. Thank you for joining me today, my curlies.